Hello students, let us continue with the DSP class. Uh, today I will cover up an example, numerical example, where if n is given as odd number, how to solve the example. Hmm? Now I will take uh, an example where x of n is given as 1, 1, 1. Okay, this is given x of n. I have to find, find discrete Fourier transform for uh, n dft for n equal to 5 hmm? n equal to 5 now uh, this is an odd number n equal to 5 is an odd number uh, let us find this first of all this is of length 3 hmm? but given n is of 5 first you make that x of n of length 5 hmm? here 1 1 1 I will add pad with two zeros so that the length became 5. It was 3, n was given as 5. I made it x of n equal to of length 5. Now I have to find the DFT. You can find DFT using uh, the method of uh, say matrix method or the normal formula method. Hmm? Uh, I will solve both matrix as well as the formula method. First let me attempt the uh, formula uh, matrix method hmm? anyway to find the matrix method or dft by normal formula you need a twiddle factor hence i have to find twiddle factor for n equal to 5 hmm? first step is to find twiddle factor now n given is 5 now first what is the basic angle basic angle is 2 pi by 5 or it is also can be taken as 360 divided by 5 which is 72 degree now uh, I have to find out all the values anyway w5 0 you know that it starts with 1 now w5 1 w5 1 is cos 1 into 72 the basic angle minus please see that minus j sin 1 into 72 hmm? cos 72 minus j sin 72 you can find the values the value comes out to be 0 0.309 minus j 0.951 hmm? use your calculator to find this similarly w52 w52 that is cos w52 i have to find out 2 into 72 minus j sin 2 into 72 you can also find out this value cos 2 into 72 is 144 you can find that the value becomes minus 0 0.809 minus j 0.588 i already used the calculator and found the values now w53 w53 is cos 3 into 72 minus j sin 3 into 72 again this value becomes minus 0 0.809 minus of minus this becomes plus j 0.588 please note that uh, sin 3 into 72 comes out to be negative value negative of this negative becomes plus j here hmm? now the last value of the twiddle factor w54 cos 4 into 72 minus j sin 4 into 72 the value is nothing but 0 0.309 plus j point 0.951 okay these are the four twiddle factor values which i have found now uh, once you know the values of the twiddle factor you can apply this twiddle factor in the formulas anyway you know two formulas of the dft the first formula is x of k is equal to summation n is equal to 0 to n minus 1 x of n e raised to minus j 2 pi by n into kn the same formula is written in this manner n is equal to 0 to n minus 1 x of n this is converted into twiddle isn't it i have told this explained it in the previous example previous classes double n raised to k right this is the most important or easily applicable formula 
the first formula the second formula is the above is kept as a matrix x of k is equal to this is taken as twiddle matrix wn into small x hmm? small xn hmm? this is the formula which is matrix formula matrix formula hmm? this this above is converted into a matrix and you have used it hmm? let me solve by the first method that is the matrix method hmm? i will use this first using matrix it is easy for you to come up with the result okay using matrix now how you will use matrix many have solved the assignment x not x1 x2 x3 and x4 hmm? because n is equal to 5 isn't it into w matrix hmm? w matrix writing w matrix is like this W five zero, 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 five times. Then W five zero, W five zero, W five zero, W five zero. Okay. Now here, no. First, you fill it with the first column and first row. Then here, first W five one. W five two, W five three, W five four. Similarly, this second column also you can fill it. W five two, W five three, W five four. Hmm? Now, then it is simply two one ja. W five two, W five four, W five six, W five eight. Two one ja two 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 ja four two three ja six two four ja eight. Now this is three one ja. Two W five six W five nine W five twelve. Three one ja three three two ja six nine and twelve. Now this is four one ja. W five eight. Hmm. W five twelve. W five sixteen. Right. This is the twiddle matrix. Now multiplied by my input x of n. That is x of n input. Hmm? Input is one, 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 zero, zero. Hmm? One, 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 zero, zero. See now, when you are writing this, sometimes many zeros may be there. You should recognize this. See. The third and uh, sorry, the fourth and fifth column are becoming zero. This reflects where here, isn't it? This reflects here. Hence, when you multiply the row and column, huh, this will get vanished. This will get vanished, isn't it? Why this goes? Because there are two zeros here, isn't it? Because of these two zeros. This multiplying, for example, W five zero multiplied by zero zero. W five zero multiplied by zero is zero. Similarly, W five three multiplied by zero is zero. W five four multiplied by zero is zero. Hence, this reflection is this that these last two columns hmm, will vanish. Hmm? No need for you to take that. Now, because of this, no, it becomes very simple for me to write. For example, now x not, hmm? and also these are simply one one one, isn't it? Because of that, W five zero multiplied by one is W five zero. W five zero multiplied by one is one. Uh, w five zero. W five zero multiplied by one is also W five zero. Hence, it is simply adding these two because of these ones. Hmm? Anyway, if some other number is there, you can multiply and add it, isn't it? Simple uh, row to column multiplication and addition. Hmm? My X zero answer is W five zero plus W five zero. Plus W five zero, which is one plus one plus one, which is three. Hmm? Similarly, X one, hmm? X one, W five zero multiplied by one, that is W five zero plus W five one plus W five two. Hmm? Uh, already you know W five zero value is one plus point three zero nine. 
माइनस जे पॉइंट नाइन फाइव वन माइनस डब्ल्यू फाइव टू वैल्यूज माइनस पॉइंट एट जीरो नाइन माइनस पॉइंट फाइव एट एट प्लीज यू कैन गेट द आंसर्स एक्स वन वैल्यू एस कम आउट टू बी प्लीज वेरीफाई द आंसर पॉइंट फाइव माइनस जे वन पॉइंट फाइव थ्री एट सिमिलरली एक्स टू वैल्यू एक्स टू वैल्यू इज डब्ल्यू फाइव जीरो प्लस डब्ल्यू फाइव टू प्लस डब्ल्यू फाइव फोर डब्ल्यू फाइव फोर एक्स टू वैल्यू नाउ द आंसर कम आउट टू बी पॉइंट फाइव पॉइंट फाइव प्लस जे पॉइंट थ्री सिक्स फोर सिमिलरली एक्स थ्री एक्स थ्री वैल्यू डब्ल्यू फाइव जीरो डब्ल्यू फाइव थ्री डब्ल्यू फाइव जीरो प्लस डब्ल्यू फाइव थ्री प्लस डब्ल्यू फाइव सिक्स डब्ल्यू फाइव सिक्स मीन्स वॉट डब्ल्यू फाइव सिक्स मीन्स डब्ल्यू फाइव वन डब्ल्यू फाइव सिक्स मीन्स डब्ल्यू फाइव वन इज इट हेन्स हेन्स यू कैन सब्स्यूट द वैल्यू ऑफ डब्ल्यू फाइव वन फ्रॉम हियर एंड यू कैन फाइंड द आंसर इट कम्स अप टू बी पॉइंट फाइव माइनस जे पॉइंट थ्री सिक्स फोर सिमिलरली एक्स फोर वैल्यू एक्स फोर वैल्यू कॉन्स टू बी डब्ल्यू फाइव जीरो डब्ल्यू फाइव फोर प्लस डब्ल्यू फाइव एट डब्ल्यू फाइव एट मीन्स वॉट डब्ल्यू फाइव एट मीन्स डब्ल्यू फाइव थ्री ओके डब्ल्यू फाइव थ्री अगेन डब्ल्यू फाइव थ्री वैल्यू यू कैन सर्च टू थियर एंड यू विल गेट द आंसर एस पॉइंट फाइव पॉइंट फाइव प्लस जे वन पॉइंट फाइव थ्री एट हेन्स माई फाइनल आंसर इज दिस एक्स जीरो एक्स वन एक्स टू एक्स थ्री एक्स फोर इज इक्वल टू इज इक्वल टू here the first answer is 3 3 and then 0.5 minus j 1.538 x2 value is 0.5 plus j 0.364 x3 value is 0.5 minus j 0.364 x4 value is 0.5 Plus J one point five three eight. This is my answer. Okay, this is my answer. Okay, like this I use the matrix method, same as the previous. Only thing is, uh, this was an odd number. N was odd. Hmm? N was odd. Uh, like five. Any any arbitrary number also given seven six whatever number is given, you can use this method, matrix method. Hmm? The next uh, board. or next slide i will explain you how to use this formula hmm? how to use this formula same as that hmm? uh, same as the same matrix method only uh, it is applying this hmm? that's all i hope you understood this uh, uh, numerical example okay what i did 1 1 1 only three number was given n was given as 5 hmm? i appended with two zeros hmm? and then found the twiddle factor applied it in the matrix hmm? row to column multiplication and i simplified because of these two zeros i removed last two columns hmm? and i came for the came for the final answer hmm? i just go through this uh, next board i will just explain you in this video session only how to solve this same example if i use this formula okay okay let us continue as i told you same problem uh, i am solving it with this formula that's all hmm? Where the formula is x of k is equal to summation n is equal to zero to n minus one x of n double n raised to k n. Okay. Now, uh, how exactly to apply this formula? Uh, if you apply this formula, what happens is n becomes zero to n minus one. That is, n equal to four. Hmm? You have to expand x of n and you have to multiply with double n raised to k n. Hmm? Now, now for that, no, the simple way is you write uh, here x not. X one, X two, hmm? and X three, X four. I am not writing because they are zero and zero. Hmm? 
Now, here you have to apply this formula now. X of 0. Hmm? X of 0 is equal to simply x naught into w phi 0. If I expand this, hmm? n is 5 and this plus x1 into w phi 0 plus x2 into w phi 0 plus nothing is there 0 plus 0 you can find the answer hmm? similarly x1 okay x1 x1 becomes equal to x0 w phi 0 plus x1 w phi 1 hmm? w phi 1 because it is simply 1 into 1 w phi 1 now plus x2 into w phi 2 plus 0 plus 0 hmm? you can get the answer similarly x2 is equal to x naught w phi 0 plus x1 w phi 2 now hmm? w phi 2 plus x2 w phi 2 into 2 2 into 2 that is w phi 4 plus anyway these are 0 values 0 plus 0 you can get the answer similarly x3 is equal to x naught w phi 0 plus x1 w phi 3 w phi 3 plus x2 into w phi 3 into 2 6 hmm? plus 0 plus 0 hmm? you will get the answer similarly x4 is equal to x naught w phi 0 plus x1 hmm? x1 w phi 4 isn't it w phi 4 plus x2 hmm? w phi hmm? what 4 into 2 that is w phi 8 plus 0 plus 0 hmm? you will get the answer same matrix formula only hmm? i am trying to keep it in this manner 0 into 0 1 into 0 2 into 0 hmm? 0 into 1 0 1 into 1 is w phi 1 2 into 1 is w phi 2 hmm? like that hmm? that's all uh, any formula you can use it doesn't matter hmm? uh, whatever you feel easy you can apply sometimes matrix method becomes easy sometimes this formula becomes easy hmm? later you will understand where exactly to apply this formula where exactly to apply the uh, matrix formula hmm? uh, i hope uh, you understood the two methods for solving okay uh, see the next you can solve as an assignment take x of n is equal to 1 1 1 1 okay and you have to find out dft for n equal to 8 hmm? find discrete Fourier transform hmm? this is assignment 3 okay assignment 3 hmm? any method you can use it doesn't matter matrix method or this method i want you to get the answer today only okay Please submit the assignment so that I will be, I can be confident that you are following the lectures and solving. Hmm? And the lectures will be only for 15 minutes, not more than that. But I want you to go through the lecture sessions and uh, solve the examples or assignments which are given. I hope if any doubts are there, you can uh, contact me regarding that. Okay, thank you.